one. I need five cc's and this is only a one cc syringe that I've got here. Because I couldn't find one that this little needle would fit on. Two. Four. Five. Oops, just gotta do it slow because come out and be careful. Five. And I put a little neosporin on the on the tip here so it doesn't run out while it's in the dark gun. Put a little needle sporin on the tip. Dry it off a little bit. Over here's one that we darted already. give you a chart for how many cc dart you're using and how far away you're judging you are to how much you uh, pump this thing up so I'm gonna go four pumps and I wish you would look the other way so I don't shoot you in the eyeball can you see blank ready all right here we go oh Comfort, I guess. I think I would maybe go five pumps on a 5cc that far away. It just seems a little arky to me. Now, where's the lid for all this crap? There's the lid for this. And where's that brown? Where's that first one we shot? It's still in her neck, isn't it? Okay, well, that's how we do it. Here's the cover for the for that little needle. This is like a little 14 gauge needle they give you to fill them darts. So, all right, pretty cool, huh? Well, so here's one that we shot with a next to a new one, and they got that little wax deal on the on the needles and eventually that melts from body heat and then it falls out but hang on to see if it actually the plunger come through you just take your other needle and you shove it down in there and see how far it goes yep see and that's how far you, the needle will go in now and so when you line that up that means the plunger in there uh, went ahead and fired and pushed it, pushed it through. So, so this one's spent. We can play with this one with uh, making target practice or something with it. 
later.